welcome back to the vlog. I said welcome back to the blog. Welcome back to the blog. Yeah, whatever it is, I hope you've been enjoying the videos we've been posting for that reveal with Rosanna Pincino. They are so lovely, it was a lot of fun, but we are back to our casual vlogs. And this beautiful green screen here is actually not a green screen. No, this is our we've living been room. Busy. <laughs> we've been busy decorating for Christmas and we managed to grab some clips of that. And Thanksgiving. We got some clips of Thanksgiving in between all of the cooking and eating. And Charlie. Mm -hmm. Oh yes, Charlie, our nephew. This was the first time, in. the first time I got to meet Charlie, which was pretty amazing. He's so cute. But uh, we have a whole bunch of stuff to post. And when, when we're done, we'll roll the clips. We're actually gonna give you some updates on our holiday decor. Yeah. Alrighty. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that, was <laughs> that was Sven. Oh, how dare you push his face like that? We are starting to gra grab our Christmas decorations. This is the ladder for Santa. Yeah. The rooftop. There. We'll need the Santa hats. Did I already grab yeah, those? Oh yeah, they're over here. Yeah. Okay. So this is a heavy. Oh. This is for the outside of the door. So oh, I can yeah. bring this on and putting the uh, lights and everything up this week. Do you want me to take? I got this one. I have a strategy. I use the ladder as a little track. Alright. Okay. We meant to put up the Christmas tree right after Halloween, actually before Halloween, um, and we never got around to it. So now we're doing it before Thanksgiving. Yeah, Drew likes to have the Christmas tree up until like July, from like November to July. I, I do? Me? Yeah. Me? yeah. Oh. You said it. Yay or nay? It's only yay. I think I want to keep it more neutral. Mm -hmm. what do you think? We can do that. Yeah, because we've gone more traditional and colorful for a few yeah. years. Although I'm still gonna take all of the. Um... Yeah. Oh, there it is. There you yeah, go. Thank you. I'm gonna take all of the handmade ones out. Those, oh yeah. Those are too cute to keep it in. Um, so are these the inside? They're coming in. Yeah. Out? Those are the stockings. Have you gone through this one yet? That one, no. Oh, we made snowflakes last year. <laughs> We can make I mean, this. I used to make these by the hundreds back in elementary school days. We can have some green. I offered to give Drew my shoulder to sit on. Mm -hmm. But she's an elf on the shelf, so <laughs> she's very used over there. Oops. You can get the little things that I keep dropping. <laughs> so we're candy cane striping the walls. Getting ourselves ahead of the game here. One, ahead of the game. One down. Game. Uh, the Christmas game. Oh, it's still November. <laughs> Camera up inside drop. <laughs> so Drew is taking care of these. Get right. Linda is taking care of the tree. I'm gonna take care of the tree. Am I in the frame? Yes, you are. <laughs> It's naked. I striped the, the walls. Candy stripes are up. You get the. We're uh, almost done. Yeah, so to clean up a little bit. We're gonna add some garland and a few different things. But yeah. I still have to finish the mantle. Um, I I feel like does the tree look a little empty? I don't know. Do you guys think we should add a little bit more to the tree? I mean, we have the. We have a few ornaments. We actually stripped down. We have we have probably four times this number of ornaments, but we tried to go a little bit more yeah. minimal. And we just kept <laughs> just the pieces we love the most, but yeah. I still like it. Yeah, yeah. We have to finish the mantle, clean up a bit, and then 
What yeah. else? I think that's about it. I mean, we'll we'll keep you up to date. We'll, we'll keep you up to date. <laughs> we'll keep you up to date on all the things that we do for the holiday. Um, still a couple of decor things and yeah, family. We'll, we'll get we'll in here. We'll try to film as much as possible. Sorry, I interrupted you. Yes, family. Visiting. Yeah. <laughs> so Linda's side, my side. It's gonna be fun to have everyone together. All right, I will be making sweet potato mash, apple cider, and I still have to pull out the stuff for Yorkshire pudding. All right, I'm gonna cut up some stuff for the salad. I had some leftover carrot sticks and I'm just gonna peel them and throw them into the salad. Take you back rubs while you. I will right. accept that. All right, we. Take over? Uh, sure. Or do you want to like um, pick the avocados? Mm -hmm. I'll make a salad dressing out of that. We are making. No, we're not making dinner. We're making part of dinner. Wes is pretty much making. So part we're the sous chefs. Uh, and Wes Drew's is my Drew shoes. Yeah. Drew... I'm the Drew sous. <laughs> Drew sous chef. Yeah. But it's a, a team effort, so I'll do some Yorkshire pudding. Uh, I'll prep a few things for Lindy. Woo! Linda's doing a couple of the other um, I'm gonna appetizers. I'm going to use sweet potato mash mm -hmm. and the salad and apple cider, which is, I'll have to get you to chop up the apples. Mm, totally. I and cut myself the other day when I was slicing oranges. Then basically Wes is creating like a 20 course meal. Yeah. Literally. I don't even know what's meal. in it, but it's gonna be amazing. There's pie, there's Th that's all we know. Yeah, that's there's all I can. Pie, care. there's pumpkin pie and apple pie. Mm -hmm. And that's the main course. I'm not sure, but it should be fun. And then I am really excited to set the table, but I don't know if I have time to do like a good job. This is like the slowest like uh, peeling I've ever seen. I knew he was gonna say that. And also, I did say Drew would be faster at this. Because I'm scared of cutting myself again. Mmm, look, they're like carrot ribbons. Mm -hmm. Did you used to help your mom and dad make dinner? My mom. She was the chef in the house. dinner? Oh yeah, my dad was never a part of it. <laughs> he, she liked to cook, he did not. Sound familiar. <laughs> I don't mind if I have the time. You mean if you make the time? If I make, I wouldn't say it's my, my, my like, I love to cook, but I will do it. But like breakfast, I actually enjoy more than most yeah. others. All right, I'm making an avocado salad dressing. So there's avocados, obviously, lemon juice, salt, pepper, and... Linda was supposed to add <laughs> two avocados and she did eight. <laughs> Whoopsies. No, not eight. Yeah. Five. Okay. Close. I'm pretty sure it was one of five. It was five, it was five. Charlie, you gonna watch me make dressing? Yeah? Your Ready? Mm -hmm. yeah. I have a cuter one. Oh. 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 Too thick? Too thick like his feet! Aww. Oh. <laughs> Whoop, whoop. Probably should have thrown these in first before I boil it. Mm. Order smarter. You're making it your own. As always. What? Somebody's coming into the room. Hi, Charlie. So, you coming to help? Yeah. You coming to help? Yeah. Yeah. Hi, Hickey. <laughs> That's a lovely Scott Living basket you have there. Mmm. All right, now we just let it boil for a while. I added a bit of sugar, cinnamon, nutmeg, and Charlie's gonna throw this in. Oh. We put that in and put it over here. Right in here, ready? And let go. Good Yay! job, buddy. Good job. Good job. Do you need some water? Need some water? Let's <laughs> some water. 
Yay! The Yorkshire pudding party is about to begin. Linda's famous recipe. That I just stole off of BBC. But it was still a great one. <laughs> so growing up, my mom made the best Yorkshire pudding. Always made it for special occasions. Thanksgiving and everything, Christmas. And I fell in love. And then Linda started making it and put her own little twist on it. And it was amazing. Wait, are you saying you fell in love with me or the Yorkshire pudding? Oh, I fell in love with you because of the Yorkshire pudding. Yeah. Oh, I knew it. I knew it. <laughs> whisk me away, Drewby. Sometimes I use a whisk. And then sometimes, like my mom, I like to splash. You like uh, to splash? Just to, uh, no, I like to you use, use a fork. Use a fork. I feel like you can get it a little stronger. Yorkshire pudding round one. Oh. All right. 20 minutes. So the recipe that Lindy shared with me for the Yorkshire pudding is a British recipe. And so instead of using cups, they're using milliliters and grams. And uh, I preheated the oven to 230 degrees of Celsius, not Fahrenheit. So I'm wondering after 20 minutes why it's not taking shape. And it's because I was over half the temperature I should have been. It's surprising how fast Yorkshire pudding takes shape when you put the right temperature. <laughs> Ooh. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. Wow. Yorkies are done. Just letting those ones cool and we'll add them to the bowl, but we get first hey, bites. Hey, this one's half eaten. I already took a couple of bites. Mm. What do you think? Mm. I don't know, I have to try it again. <laughs> Even after um, me using Celsius instead of Fahrenheit, potentially wrong measurements because it was too liquidy, balanced it out like a real pro. It was so good. Thank mm. you. Mm. Made some salad, yogurt, and avocado, and lemon, apple, carrot, pomegranate, sweet potato mash. Made apple cider. There's apple pie by Wes. This is all Wes. This is just me. This is for me. Yeah. <laughs> and look, he made fresh friggin' rolls. Like like those homemade. Milk those milk rolls, buns. milk buns are gonna go to these buns. <laughs> and those are rustic buns right here. Oh gosh. <laughs> rustic double crispy. bun. Oh. Wow. This is actually the first turkey I've ever carved because I've had my mom and dad who do it, or when I've been with the rest of the family, they do it, so. <gasps> Little treasures. <laughs> Our placemats are thankful messages. messages. This was from our sous chef, Will. Chef. Over here, from Silly Audrey. <laughs> oh, I am thankful for Drew because you were silly. Aww. <laughs> There's the chef. There he is. Looking dapper, chef. Chef Wes. Mmm, <gasps> yummy, yummy, yummy. All right, try it, Drewby. Okay. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers, everybody. Is it really good? So good. Uh, okay. Yay! Yeah. Okay. Let's see if y'all are just being. Nice. Let's see if the chef likes her own apple cider. It's great. Yeah. Ah. Uh, marketing campaign brought to you by April. Oh, thanks, guys. This is what it's all about. Yep. Good food and great company. Mm -hmm. is this in that order? Here? Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's a lot of fun having family right next door, and we have great time. Great you're able to come visit as well, and that you guys are in town. Yep. Mm -hmm. Makes for a, a happy home having you guys next door. Mm -hmm. Aww. Hug. Hug. Hug, honey. Aww. 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 Look at that big hug. Squeeze is so hard. Aww. Aww. Happy Thanksgiving! All right, so the big update on our decorating. <laughs> we're still here and we're still decorating. We're still decorating, but Linda did do a really cool piece. We'll give you a little up close and personal. Yeah, it's just a tiny thing. Yeah, but she like, handcrafted it. She cut it out herself and made a little cityscape. All right, this is Linda's cityscape. 
I just wanted to feel like a giant. <laughs> I think it looks great. I thought you bought this. I thought this was a little thing that you can, you know, buy at the store, which I'm sure you can, but you just made it your own. You put some of the string lights yeah. in behind. I was um, just doodling and cutting while watching Cruella. A very mm. Christmassy movie. <laughs> Christmassy movie. That's it for our video. We <laughs> hope you've enjoyed. Be sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell. We have new videos coming, but we will see you oh, at the next video. If you've gotten this far. We want to know your favorite Christmas movie. Yes, comment below. Let us know your favorite Christmas movie. Tonight we're watching a Christmas movie and building gingerbread houses. Yes, so it's important you have to move fast. Have a good one.